Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today we're tackling a puzzling issue that many TypeScript developers encounter. Our viewer is facing TSLint errors while working with asynchronous operations using async and await. The question is, what could this be about? Let's dive in and unravel the mystery behind these error messages. All right guys, we're back with another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully you find your solution that you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on to the video. In this video, we'll address the TSLint error message. Promises must be handled appropriately. This error typically occurs when a promise is not awaited or handled correctly. Let's take a look at the first function, getRequest. This function returns a promise from the request promise library. However, in the getStatus function, we need to ensure that we handle this promise correctly. In the getStatus function, we are using await to handle the promise returned by getRequest. However, if getStatus is called without awaiting it, it can lead to the TSLint error. To fix the issue, ensure that when you call getStatus, you either await it or handle the promise it returns. This will prevent the promises must be handled appropriately error. Lastly, remember to check the TSLint rules specifically the no floating promises rule, which enforces that all promises must be handled. You can find more information in the TSLint documentation. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. The TSLint error indicates that your getStatus function returns a promise, but you didn't handle it properly. You called getStatus without using .then. To fix this, simply add .then to your call. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. If you're writing an async function in TypeScript, you might encounter a TSLint error if you forget to handle promises correctly. This often happens when you forget to use the await keyword, especially on the last line of your function. For example, if you have a function that calls an async function without a wait, you'll get an error. To fix this, simply add a wait before the async function call. Correcting it is easy. Just add a wait to ensure the promise is handled properly. This not only resolves the error, but also improves your debugging experience. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. This user explains how to fix the TSLint error about handling promises. They suggest awaiting the getStatus function since it's asynchronous. The error message is clear, but the line number can be misleading. They also mention that disabling these specific errors isn't advisable as they help ensure the code runs asynchronously.
And that's it guys. I hope this video has helped you find that solution that you're looking for. If it did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.